Go eat that body. Go eat the body. No, you all stay there. And then, here, close this door as well. And then we'll just pretend that I never did anything so dumb as open that place up to those rats. Wait, did you touch the door handle to Dr. Galvani's lab? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Then you have to scrub. The rats get their vital essences everywhere, the doctor said. Ooh, vital essences. Vital essences? Does that mean guts? I think so. So your hands need scrubbing. You're unclean. Unclean? unclean. That's nonsense. Can't we just- No, I told you. With rubbing alcohol or white vinegar. All right, all right. What is he doing there all day? Ambrose says he breeds rats that carry the plague. Your friends are ignorant. The doctor is a brilliant man. If anyone can save this city, it's him. The royal physician is going to save us. Meyer's new elixir is twice as good against the plague. I don't understand how Galvani can admire Sokolov. Royal physician or not, I hear tell he's a beast. A superstitious philanderer who spends more time with prostitutes than he does in the laboratory. <laughs> is this what it's going to be like when we're married? It is, isn't it? <laughs> I hope not. I'm telling you now, I don't have the endurance for it. <laughs> is this what it's going to be like when we're married? God dang it, Martha. I can't, I can't do this. <sighs> I'm just gonna. You can go there. There you go, buddy. You can just you can just go in there. Ah! What will I do now? Okay. So there's some bullshit around here, I guess? Somewhere? Ooh, sleep darts. Excellent. Just what I needed. Pocket watch. Excellent. A chest. Is it G T? Ah, oh? aha. Ah. Oh. No, it was one of these buttons. Looks like some more traps. Yep, some more spring razors. I'm probably not going to use them. Okay, so I need the building key. Which I apparently don't have. Uh, strain your efforts strictly to the floors. Please at all costs refrain from attempting to clean or arrange my bookshelf. In fact, it would be best to keep away from it altogether. Otherwise, I'll have to reconsider the terms of your employment. Okay, so Galvani's not here at all. Okay, so I can basically do whatever the fuck I want in here. Oh, hey, here's the here's the thingy with the building key, and then there is spiritual remedy there. Apparently I can't. I can't. Apparently these doors don't open without keys. Just completely. Ooh, what's this? That is the most... Well, alright. I guess that's kind of cool. Obviously the plague rat is distinct from the ordinary rat. But in what respect? In size and the coarseness of its fur, and I believe in intelligence, although the experiments there are not complete. 
Coriander Zoological Survey describes only the ordinary rat, which means plague mm. rats have only been here for five or seven years at most. This was not a gradual migration. Could they have been introduced on purpose? Perhaps by a foreign power. <gasps> Rat viscera. Poor viscera. Uh, yeah, let's go to Clavering Boulevard. Save your game often. Run, little rat. That's frigging rude. Look out. Got a prowler. What do you mean we've got a prowler? Don't be an asshole. Uh, okay, so that 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 doesn't go anywhere. I need a longer jump than I had to get there, I guess. All right, so I can get to here. And then I can get down there. And then there's a room there. Uh, the whiskey distillery, I think, is where I need to be going for this side quest, I think. Yep, nope, that's totally a rat swarm. Okay. So we're just going to jump up here and pretend that I didn't just almost get myself killed. And carry on towards. Hello, thank you. Okay, there we go. Uh, okay, so the rune that way is, is, is a bit far away. Okay, so. Onwards to victory! Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Clipped through. Just clipping on through, buddies. A gaffer's tale. Ooh, timeless children's rhymes. Excerpt from a set of cautionary tales for children. They say that Jimmy Whitcomb Riley was a brawler and his mates called Smiley. He ran around, up and down town, pulling off every kind of crimey? I... Yeah, okay, sure, why not? On Bottle Street, he hung with the boys, throwing bricks and bottles and other toys. They'd start a fight, then run and hide, breaking, laughing far and wide. Smiley liked to eat and drink all day, and smash and bash the night away. Drunk and all alone, he drifted off asleeping, sitting on the bridge along John Clavering. Clavering? Sleeping, click, clay, clavering? Click, click, click. Now that one doesn't work. No, he's away, clay. No, none of those work. When he woke, something strange he found. Stranger than a singing wolfhound. He'd become a blue-jawed hagfish, most slimy, and only remembered his name was Smiley. They say that Jimmy Whitcomb Riley was never seen again for all timey. But he swam around, up and down, drinking from the river, crying, Why me? Timeless. Fucking timeless. Whoop. Yes, let's go to the good done wall. Use blink to sneak by moving rapidly. Alright. Hatches fired the first shot, but the Bottle Street Gang fired the last. Alright. Word is, he's like a phantom. An army of shadows. This is one odd bird. Consorts with crazies, does rituals and the like. Bone charms and such. You sound afraid. Damn right I am. The doubt ain't no ordinary man. Touched by the outside of things. Get the dark power. Rat shit. You got lucky. When you're this handsome, 
You don't need luck. Face like a hagfish. <laughs> hey, uh, don't be sour. Say, when's Slackjaw coming down? Not till the next batch of elixir's done. He'll want to check on things. Then you better get all your shit together, huh? Everything's fine. I run the still like I run a game of Nancy. <laughs> yeah. I not fast enough. For what? <laughs> Just little bastard. Fucking murdering rats. Alright, cool. We are in the elixir still now. So where's this bone charm? Up there. Okay, is there a way out of this? That doesn't include me just getting completely so goes, not to the Abbey or the office of the high overseer. Blasted. One of the other places. Where they train the overseer to be real religious. You're crazy. He just wants to know where his brother's from. He sneaks in. You know where to go in at it when he's sober. I remember. Brimsley job. Hitting the dumb waiter all night. What? Yeah. So he goes from room to room. Kids sleeping. An overseer giving a lecture to the kid. Oh, right. A couple guys training with those hounds. Stuff you'd expect. But it gets weird. Some kind of machine. Ooh. Then a woman laughing. Just laughing and laughing. Then music. A kind of plinky, plonky sound. That's what spooked him. Are you sure he wasn't drunk? Says he still hears it at night. He never did find his brother. Huh? No, I ain't nobody. I ain't nobody, mate. I ain't nobody. <laughs> That's a knee slapper, Rodney. Okay, I got one for you. Well, give it. Okay, here goes. The nobleman laid with the scullery maid, so loudly they made quite a riot. The nobleman's wife took the butcher and carved herself some decent quiet. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, I get it. The wife done kind of both, right? Yeah. That's the gist. Now it's your turn. Oh, uh, let me think. Um, okay. Yeah, I got one. Ready? Oh, God, here we go. Listen. There once was a sailor from Morley who fancied a woman most sorely. He gave her his cash, she gave him a rash, and that's all. There isn't no more. <laughs> ah, you win. You win. Well, I know a hundred of these old rats. My mummy used to tell him. What? Your mother used to tell you about a guy that would give be given a rash? Yeah, alright. Yeah, sure. Whatever you say, mate. Got anything to smoke or eat? Shut up! <laughs> what? Are you actually kidding me? Must have been rats. Yeah, damn rats. Jesus. What kind of mother is like, hey, I've got this hype ass song for you. Let me see what's going on over here. Okay, so there's guy there. Can I get behind him at all? <coughs> Okay, so I totally just, I missed everyone by luck, basically. Uh, so that bone charm is up 
this. Please, thank you. 